about a year and a half ago in Jerusalem, uh, I had the opportunity to sit down with folks from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs with a couple of fellow mayors. And our whole conversation turned to, to, to the topic of how uh, support for Israel has become a partisan issue, or is on track to become a partisan issue, which is very bad news for Israel and for America, I believe. Uh, I don't support BDS. I also don't support the decisions that the current uh, government in Israel is making. And I think that it is no more anti-Israel to be skeptical of the Netanyahu government than it's on American to be skeptical of the Trump government. It's, it's that intertwining of domestic politics that is so problematic. If an American president can reach out to a foreign leader uh, with, an, um, with a domestic American political agenda and get him to do something to act against an American politician, even one that I might not agree with on these things, that sends a really troubling message and just deepens this, uh, uh, this sense that, that puts uh, those of us who believe in peace and, and in well-being for Israeli and Palestinian and American people and a two-state solution and the U.S.-Israel alliance built on, on shared values like democracy puts us in a very difficult position. And so on my watch, this will not be a partisan issue. Um, but we will do what you always do with a friend who's walking in a way you're not too sure about. You just put your arm around them and try to guide them to a way that's mutually beneficial. And I think that has to be the, uh, the overall energy behind this relationship.